Hello guys, welcome back to Susan Best TV. It's good to see you guys back again. How are you all doing? I hope fine. It's all good. Give thanks to God. So here is my um, sausage roll. Alright, if you want to know how I made the sausage roll, please watch this video to the end and tell me what you think about it. Here's my cup of milk, warm cup of milk, just warm and that is salt. I'm not gonna add sugar to it but if you want you can add your sugar so and um, there is um, just one large egg then we're gonna give it a stir we're gonna stir it until it's blend So it's time to add a flour. Now I'm going to be using two cups of flour. All right, it depends on, like I always say, it depends on how you want to use it, but I'm using two cups of flour. And also if you want to make more, you can also uh, make more. Now I use 75 gram of the bora of method bora. So now it's time for me to put it on my table where I'm going to be giving it a nice mix. So now I'm just going to knead it for about 2 minutes, not much, because I've already done almost the parts. So I'm just going to knead it a little, then I'll cover it to rest for at least 20 minutes. So now we are done, alright, so um, I'm just going to roll it a little, then before I will start um, rolling it. Now I'm cutting it piece by piece how I want it. So this is how I do it. So please guys, if you like what I'm doing here, consider to subscribe to my YouTube channel and also follow my page at Susan Kitchen. Okay, thank you so much. And to my returning subscriber, uh, will I forget to say thank you to you guys? You know, I will never forget that. I really appreciate you all. I appreciate your support, the way you support this channel. So may God bless you all. And I hope to keep seeing you in my channel. I hope to, I hope to keep seeing your suppers.
so now I'm done rolling it. Um, this is how um, I'm just going to roll it. Sorry about the camera, guys. And that place just got some something on the camera. So now when I'm done rolling it, you can roll it according to your cheese. So if you are using a, a tiny uh, cheese, so you can make your bread thinner. But if you are using a uh, white cheese, you can make your bread white. So what I'm using, I'm using a normal white cheese. So um, that's why my bread is kind of white because you, you want uh, you do to cover it a little so the cheese don't melt out. All right. So now I'm going. I'm laying three pieces of my sliced chicken. Then I'm going to lay two pieces of my cheese on it. Then I will be doubling it again with two sliced chicken before I will start rolling it. While you are rolling it, make sure you are holding it tight because you know cheese is very is hard, kind of hard. So make sure you are holding it hard and you are pressing the side so you don't melt from the from the side out. So this is exactly what I'm doing now. So I'm going to chop in the the, the both edges to make it close. I'm just closing it.
now i'm going to turn in my blended bread so this is what i'm going to be using to wrap my dough and one large egg so um this i'll just mix it together Then I'll use it. I'll use the brush just to brush the egg into my dough, little by little. Then I also, when I'm done um, doing the first part, I'm gonna turn the dough, then do it to make sure it covers everything. So after that, I'm going to put it in my blended bread, which is blended semi. Okay, so this is how I'm going to just rub it before I'll leave it for about five minutes, then I'll start the frying. So we're going to be using a low heat to fry our dough all right don't let it hurt because you know the cheese roll is heavy so when you don't make it low when you don't lower your heat it will be burning but it won't cook so to prevent that use a very low heat to fry your dough okay guys now it's too hot i'm going to reduce it and you will see how it cooks later you see this is how the the temperature we want to use so it can cook and don't make it be too low so your your dough don't soak oil so you just have to to keep watching and keep turning it all right guys i think that's the end of this video if you watched it this time thank you so much i say may god bless you i hope to see you in my next video please if you like what i'm doing here and tell me in the comment section and if there's anyone anything you also want me to make any food you want me to make let me know and i will make it thank you so much and Bye.